By the way, these dishes are clean. They're just drying. They're not dirty. Please stop judging me. Hi, it's Tuesday, and you're watching Tasty Tuesday, the show where it's Tuesday, and I try to make something tasty. Sometimes it works. Right? Sometimes it works. So today we're making pizza. I've gotten so many requests to make pizza. One time I tried to make pizza like a couple years ago with the dough from Trader Joe's and it went disastrously and I have not attempted it since. But this time I feel like I picked probably the easiest way you could make pizza besides like a frozen pizza and I'm really hoping it doesn't taste like a frozen pizza because I don't like the way those taste. So I was reading online and they said that you should use like a pizza stone. I could not find a pizza stone anywhere. But I did find this thing though, this air bake pan. Look, they got a, a pizza going on there. It looks pretty good. I trust it. We'll be making a pineapple mushroom pizza today. That's my favorite pizza. It sounds weird. I know. It isn't though. Don't knock it till you try it. It's really, really good. Steve doesn't care for it, but I think oh. it's amazing. It's a texture thing. We're doing pineapple mushroom pizza. I really hope it turns out. I hope it's a pizza cake. <laughs> I hope it's as easy as pie. East Coasters, why do you call it that? It's confusing. Let's make this dish. So this is the pizza crust that I'm using today. Doesn't it look easy? So I'm just gonna follow the instructions on the back. Preheat your oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. You got it. Next, we're gonna grease the pan or the cooking sheet. Great. Unroll dough onto pan. Okay, so how, how do you, is there a trick to this? Yes. Is that, this feels wrong. Is this right? Ah, oh, I think I fucked it up. Who made you? The devil made you. How does this, how do you even, god damn it. I'm gonna make this pizza. I don't know what I'm doing here. This is not a gimmick. I'm not trying to be quirky. I just legit can't open this thing. Why do you even exist like this? Oh, it just wanted me to peel that so it has an instruction underneath, like a secret instruction. I need a spoon for this? A spoon at sea. The fuck? Get off. Piece of crap. Oh, I think it just popped. It popped. Oh, it's like a firework. Oh, okay, I have it. I have it. It says to unroll this joint. Begin. Okay, okay. Got it. I got it. I got it. Oh no. Now I fucked up my instructions. Unroll. Okay. It's weird because this is a square and this is a circle. It's not making sense in my brain. I want to fix it. You know what? That's good enough. You're like a squircle, like a rectangle. I wonder if this is how Peyton Manning felt when he opened Papa John's. Next, we're gonna put on some pizza sauce. I chose this one because it says organic. Whatever brand this is, Muir Glen Organic, their marketing totally got me because it feels like it'd be something really healthy and I've been using them in a couple different dishes. I use them for the chicken parmesan and for the lasagna and it's been really good. This is their pizza sauce. I feel like Peyton Manning would love it. Put it on there, sauce it up, get saucy. How many cans of this am I supposed to add? I bought two just just in case, but I feel like it's just one, right? I'm just gonna dump the whole thing on there. This looks like a pizza sauce spreader, right? Yeah, you look good. I'm gonna put it all the way to the edges because I like sauce. You know when you get to like the end of the pizza and there's no sauce on the crust? That's the most bummer part of the pizza for me. I like there to be just a plentiful amount of sauce. Now you know a lot of things about pizza, about me, about me and pizza together. I feel a lot closer to you. I think it's gonna be good. Do you remember pizza Lunchables? My mom would never buy it for me, but one time I saved up my allowance and I got it on my own. Screw you, mom. Anyway, this tastes like the pizza sauce in that. Then what? Instructions? Cheese. I think mozzarella cheese is the cheese that goes on pizza. If not, we're doing mozzarella cheese. How much though? It doesn't say. This is like a free-for-all making a pizza. I ended up using about half this bag of mozzarella. You could probably do more if you wanted to do more. I remember in the pizza Lunchables, I used to use all the cheese on the first pizza and then I wouldn't have any cheese for the other pizzas and it was kind of a bummer. It came with three pizzas, but I could never get the third pizza to actually be a pizza because I used up all the ingredients on the other two. Things that you know now that you never needed to know and now you know them and now they're taking up space in your brain. So I, these are white, already sliced mushrooms because I didn't want to do any extra work. If you want to slice your own mushrooms, go nuts. Do it. Pizza cake. These mushrooms are huge for this pizza. Good job, you look good so far. Next, I'm going to add pineapple tidbits. I made sure to get the tidbits because the pineapple chunks are huge. Just like I wasn't expecting those mushrooms to be, but they are, but that's okay. We don't have to make the same mistake with the pineapple that we made with the mushrooms. Pineapple tidbits. Did it. Do it. Going heavy on the pineapple because it looks delicious. That looks really good. I'm really excited to eat this actually. I'm gonna go back in with the mozzarella because this pizza is letting me do whatever I want to it. And I'm just gonna sprinkle a little bit on the toppings because I kind of like when the cheese envelops the toppings in sweet gourmet when that happens. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling very patent. Now we're gonna bake nine to 15 minutes or until the crust is golden brown and cheese is melted. I'm gonna put it in for 
11 minutes and we'll check and see if it needs more time. This is easy. Hopefully it's tasty. Why did I never do this as a kid? Yeah. I feel like if I hadn't been talking in between putting toppings on the pizza and all that stuff, it's probably a lot faster than ordering pizza. And you get to put whatever you want on it. So cool. Dude, a kid would totally love this. Why did I never get to do this? Thanks, mom. The crust is like, wait, just kicking it until the pizza is done. I'm gonna make a drink. Did I keep it sexy? I mix this with this, and then I added pineapples and some of the pineapple juice from the pineapples. I highly suggest this with your pizza. I think it's a good pairing. You know how you pair food with different alcohols? Yes. I'm impressed with myself. Try this drink I made. Oh my god. Can I have one? Yeah. It's really good. Holy Tasty Tuesday. Yeah, that's the best reaction I've ever had on a Tasty Tuesday. <laughs> it is. Better than any of the food reactions you've had. Dude, this shit is good as hell. Bro. Right. right on. You guys keep on doing what you're doing. I'm drunk. I'm going to party. I'm like, <laughs> hey, don't let me get in the way. Just keep doing what you're doing. All right. Party time. Everybody. Right. Thanks, Uncle Steve. Cookie, bitch. She's ready. I am turned up for this pizza. Are you looking good in there? You think you're Dumb, maybe? Yes, it's definitely it looks great. I'm excited. It's very Peyton Manning over here. Oh, look what I got. Pizza cutter. It's like one of those things that when you go with your mom to the grocery store when you're a kid and you really wanted to get a pizza cutter. She's like, no, that's an unnecessary utensil. You never got one. Thanks a lot, mom. Can we cut this yet? Is it ready? How long do I have to wait? How did this get dirty already? Cut this up with my pizza slicer and serve it up. Eat it up. Cut it into pieces. I don't. Sorry. <gasps> ah! I'm trying to participate. This is hard to cut. This is probably the hardest thing of this whole thing. Ow. Ow. Too hot. I guess we're done. Now let's see if it's tasty. You are looking fabulous. And you over here, the chosen ones. Upon first observation, I feel like I could have gotten a little bit more heavy handed on the cheese. I didn't know that cheese shrinks in the oven. And for the amount of sauce I put on, I should have put more cheese, but. Just quite a bit of bread. I put so much cheese, it thought It looks like lasagna. But it, um, you know, it shrunk. So, you know, use a lot of cheese. Be generous with your cheese. Yeah, if you're gonna heat up a pizza yourself. <laughs> Damn, that's really good. Is it? Yeah. Yay! I mean, I set myself up to make possibly the most easiest what pizza sauce is that? ever. It's this or okay, see that's what I'm talking about. This organic brand sauce. I've been using it in all the red sauce dishes and it's been it's killing legit it. Excellent sauce. It's great. This was a really tasty, easy meal. Do it with your kids, do it with your boyfriend, do it with your family. It's really it's a really fun time. Also make drinks. That's Dude, also a fun make time. Make drinks though. <laughs> that drink with this pizza, that's a good night. Tasty Tuesday! It's a good night. Where do my hair ties go to? Where do they leave me? I hope wherever they are, I hope they're out there having fun. I miss them. I wish they knew that. Hey, you guys keep doing your thing though. If you want it a little melty, that's totally fine. I don't want to tell you guys what to do. You guys can feel it out. You're making your first pizza. That's pretty cool. Okay, thanks Uncle Steve. Yeah, I remember making my first pizza. It's a funny story. Um, you know, you me and your mom, your mom back, back in the day. In the yeah, day. we had a Ford Aerostar. Ford remember Aerostar, that? Yes. Yeah, we went uh, to the, the, the meat market. The meat market, yeah. we, we picked out the pepperonis ourselves because back then you had to pick it all out yourself, right? You couldn't just go to the store and get a package and have all the stuff conveniently sliced out for you. You had to buy a whole thing of pepperoni and you slice it up yourself. And one time you cut off your finger. Cut my finger right off. Yeah, right at the joint. The right at the joint. You said you couldn't even feel it. Couldn't feel it. But but that, that but then I felt it later. You know, I have phantom yeah. pain. Yeah, that's why I drink. Got the phantom pain. All right. Hey, okay. you kids have fun. I'll be upstairs. You guys hang out in the kitchen basement.